In today's video, I will be deep cleaning my kitchen, going through our leftovers in the fridge. Um, we will be prepping some veggies for lunches this week, um, getting those ready for my husband so he can take them to work with him. We will be doing tons of laundry while I multitask. Hey friends, welcome back to Happy Homemakers. I hope you are thriving this week. My name is Nikki and I am a homeschooling mama to five boys ages 11, 6, 4, 3, and 3 months. Today I'll be giving my kitchen a good deep clean, wiping down my appliances, cleaning out my fridge so that way it's ready for this week's grocery shopping to be put away. Um, you'll see my two little helpers there, that's my 4 year old and my 3 year old and they have color changing cars. So if we put them in the deep freezer, they change to one color. They get them out, they want me to put blow hot air on them so that they'll change colors again and then they'll immediately put them back in the deep freezer. So you'll see them running in and out a lot. I love using these reusable Ziploc bags for my husband's lunches. I fill them with vegetables. Um, we usually do one that has like fruit and yogurt in it and I make a little parfait. Um, they're just really great because we can wash them out and use them over and over again. So when I do a deep clean in my kitchen, I generally don't have to wipe down all of my cabinets. Um, this week has been really warm for us, so our kids have been outside every day this week and they come inside and their hands are gross. Um, but that's the one reason that I really love these white cabinets is because anytime there's even a little bit of dirt on them, I can see it and I can just wipe it down immediately. Um, it's one of those things that just irritates me when I see it, so it gets done. Um, it just happened to be that this week they were extra dirty because we've been outside.
So we use a lot of butter bowls for our Tupperware to put leftovers in. Um, that's one of the things that I really want to get in the next few months is some matching Tupperware for my pantry and for my leftovers so that I can see everything. Because as you can see, I have to open everything to see what it is and whether it's any good or not. Um, I think it'll just save me a lot of time and I'll be able to see everything better. Normally we just buy baby carrots to throw in the um, lunch bags for my husband, but this week our store did not have any baby carrots, so we just bought the big ones. I'm peeling them, washing them, and cutting them into chunks, and he'll still eat them. It's not a big deal. Um, I will also be uh, cutting up pieces of celery, and then I will be putting them into mason jars full of water, and it will help them stay crunchy. So at this point in the day, the babies were done with their homeschool work, um, but my oldest, he still had a few things left to do, things that we need to do together, um, especially like science and social studies. So before I started the laundry, we went over his lessons together, and then while he's doing his lessons, he'll sit at the table while I fold laundry, and that way we can talk about it. If he has any questions, I'm right there and I can help him.
So you'll see while I'm doing laundry, I'll be throwing some clothes into the small basket on the table. Those are my 11 year old's clothes. He is in charge of folding them and hanging them and putting them away. Um, I do wash them and dry them, but he is in charge of putting his own clothes away.
So now that I'm finished folding the laundry, I'll just be putting everything away and tomorrow I will start the laundry all over again. I actually enjoy doing laundry. I just wish it would stay done for a little bit longer. Um, I do hope that you enjoyed this video and it helped to motivate you get one thing done today. Um, thanks for watching. Happy homemakers. Thank you.